hello everyone today in this video we are going to send our pdf into email so if you are watching it from the email series or you can also watching it from the pdf generator series so it's a video is for you so this uh, guy itstitionstuff.com written a very well article on this how you can send the pdf into the email so let me open the stuff here so you need to first install the project and then you need to fill the email credential into your env file so i already filled these credentials into the env file which is used to send an email right so if you are familiar with this one if you are not you can check my laravel email series where i am starting it from the sketch that how you can uh, create your account and then get the credentials into credential and save them into the env file so it's full flash series and then you need to prepare uh, one route and uh, this route is responsible for generating the pdf file okay so in the previous videos we are generating the pdf file and saving this into our local pc right and uh, let me go here and now this one is used to send our email into the send our pdf into the email so it's a little bit uh, tricky why i'm saving uh, saying this is tricky because server allow us to perform only one operation like you can download a file or you can redirect to your user so in my case my client asked me to uh, client having a simple uh, form where user will fill this form and after successful submission of this form a pdf will be generated and uh, this uh, form will be sent to the customer email and then after successful submission this form will be redirected on the thank you page so i already told you that uh, server allow us only one operation you can either send uh, and you can uh, redirect your user on the next page or you can download the pdf so how you can um, perform these operations so after this uh, for example you generated the pdf then how you can redirect your user to the next page so if you did this so how you can send this email to your client so it's a little bit tricky and uh, now it's very simple so i find this solution and i'm sharing it with you okay let's open the project and uh, copy this stuff from there and go to our project to back and add this script here so first we need to update our email so let me add this near zcr801 at the rate of gmail.com and then here we need to add our email uh, our title so this would be uh, career development lab so this is our youtube channel name so let me add this from here from and this is one is body is good and then here we are we need to pass our view so we are passing this in the previous videos we are passing this uh, an index view right so let me open this index file it's exist in this uh, views directory it's this one so this one contain basically a basic template for sending an email right so let me update this so it uh, exists in the views so we don't need to type this email so we need to directly type the index and then this will load the pdf and then store this into a pdf object right and here we need to also reference this index so this index uh, this one right and then here we are passing the message and the pdf object and here we are grabbing this email right and this email so if we if you remove this email so you can uh, it's totally upon you you can remove this email object from there okay i think i removed something else so let me go back okay so now it's good and then subject would be title which we uh, hit here and then this would be basically this attached data is responsible for attaching any file to an email so we are attaching the and this is a pdf object and we are outputting this pdf file right and then we are naming this file text.pdf right and after this we are displaying this mail sent successfully so let's give it a try so here uh, our route is uh, generate pdf this one so let me go to the project and execute this script okay generate pdf hit enter 
and wait for a moment to complete this process and uh, let me also open the email for receiving the PDF file so wait for a moment to complete this process okay it says, it says that mail sent successfully so it means that our mail is sent successfully and this CDL where it's coming from this CDL so it's, this CDL is coming from ENV file and here we set this mail from name so you can name whatever you want and then this from would be uh, getting getting it from the title okay and then this would be our template and we also attach this in email in pdf right so this pdf name would be text.pdf which we define it in the second parameter of this attach data this one right so you can name whatever you want so you can also uh, generate the dynamic name like and you can pass the time objects it's totally upon you it's very simple and now it's generated so we can redirect our user back or whatever location we want to redirect okay so let me return and we are in the laravel 9 so we can use the return to route property which is exist in the laravel 9 so if you are using older version you can use the existing ones okay so i'm going to i'm not going to redirect on this one i'm going to redirect on the slash url okay save this one and then refresh it again so it's going to generate the pdf and then send this pdf in the email and after this successful completion it's going to on the home page and yes it's redirected on the home page so it means that we successfully sent our email and we redirected our user back so it's very simple so hope you get an idea that how you can send the pdf uh, send the pdf or any other file with the email by using the attach data method so hope you like this video if you are interested to learn more about the laravel subscribe the youtube channel and stay connected for more upcoming videos i will meet you in the next one bye bye